Hi everyone, uh, welcome to Coding Zest. In this video, I will show you how you can install and set up Laravel HUD on your Mac OS machine. And I will also show you how you can uh, use and set up PHP My Admin with Laravel HUD on your Mac OS machine. So let's get started. First of all, we need to download the Laravel HUD. So simply type Laravel HUD on your browser and open this website and click on download for Mac OS. When the download is completed, then uh, go to your downloads. I have already downloaded it to save some time. Simply open this. Okay, and drag Laravel Hard to applications. Okay, now go to applications and you can uh, close this. Uh, you can also find it uh, from Spotlight, but my Spotlight is not working. Don't know why. So here to applications and simply open this click on open and uh, it will open up the setup click on continue and type your password here okay and from here you can uh, you can use the default folder or you can choose uh, the custom folder so uh, I will uh, use the default folder and uh, I will also show you how you can uh, add your Laravel project uh, from your custom folder after installing it. So if you want to use custom folder, you can choose it from here. But uh, I will just simply stick with the, the default folder. Okay. Click on continue. Okay. By using Laravel Hard, uh, you don't need to install uh, Composer and Laravel separately. It will uh, like install all the things at one place. Okay, uh, if you want to install NVM, so click on this, but uh, I think it should uh, need the license and if you have the license, so <coughs> simply uh, put your email and license key here and you can activate it, but you can also use it for, for free. Simply uh, click on skip or no and let's get started. Okay, uh, it will open uh, the documentation, but the page is not found. Uh, it's weird because <laughs> what is the issue with it? I don't know. Okay. Uh, come to Laravel Heart. simply open this from here sites and from here you can uh, visit your sites but for now we don't have any Laravel project inside our hard folder and I will also show you where is our hard, fo hard uh, folder where it is in uh, your user folder this is my name Hilal Ahmed so this is my user folder and hard folder is here uh, now what I will do, I will just simply go to this hard folder and I think I have already in it. If you don't know, just simply type hard and you are inside it and as you can see we don't have any uh, Laravel project here. I will just simply uh, create a new project, hard testing and click enter. And as you can see Laravel is working. And choose none. Okay, for this example, I will uh, use uh, I will choose the SQL app. You can use your your own DB, and uh, I don't want to run the npm install. So if your project needs to uh, run the npm install, you can select yes. I will just simply say uh, select no. Okay, and uh, now come back to your Laravel hard and just uh, refresh this tab. And as you can see, a hard testing it uh, it is here. Okay, simply click on this link. And it will open your Laravel project and it is up and running on our uh, local environment. Okay, now I will uh, show you how you can add um, Laravel project from another folders. Okay, so uh, simply click on this add site and uh, uh, link existing project and it will open up your folders. And I have this folder Laravel projects. And let's suppose I want to add this uh, this saloon or this Laravel <coughs> React CRUD. Select this and select the PHP version. And uh, select uh, click next. And uh, close this and your project um, is here from another folder. You can also save the custom folder. But if you want to use the Laravel hard default folder and uh, add sites from another folder, then you can add it here okay now the next thing is uh, you will ask like how we uh, can use the php my admin with laravel hard so for that 
simply uh, open up your browser and type php my um, admin download download and open up you this first website which is official php my admin dot net website and you can download it from here and again i have already downloaded it to save some time and uh, here it is php my admin here it is you just need to copy it okay you just need to copy it from here and go to your user and go to your hard folder and simply paste it here okay extract it here by double clicking and leave this and we need to rename this we will rename it like php my admin and hit enter okay now uh, go back to your laravel hub and refresh this rp and you can see here php my admin dot test is here what i will do i will just simply open this and uh, it says login without a password is forbidden by user permission let me try it yes so to fix this issue come back to your php my admin folder and here as you can see the config sample file just simply duplicate it okay and uh, remove this copy from here and remove this sample so the file name should be config.inc.php simply open this in a code editor or a text editor and uh, come to the line number 32 and allow no password is false so we will click true save this uh, go back to your browser where the php my admin is and simply refresh it and it will say well and uh, okay uh, cannot log in to the mysql server uh, for this uh, we need a mysql server and uh, to start our mysql so what we will do we will uh, download the db engine db engine oh sorry i uh, typed db engine but it's, it's db engine go to the official website and download it from here for your mac os and i have already downloaded it so i will go to my downloads and here i will open it okay take this to applications okay done go to applications and open it from here okay very fine click on open and it will open the db engine and uh, i think i didn't read it uh, right fully so it says the server is running but uh, if you install it for the first time and you don't see any uh, database or mysql server here then uh, don't worry you just need to click on this plus icon and here uh, we have postgres uh, sql mysql maria maria db and redis uh, you can choose your database i will choose mysql and i will name it mm, like mysql but i i have already created it so i will not create it but you can uh, put the your uh, server name sql server name and the port is uh, uh, double uh, 306 and it if this port is given by some another application and or uh, another database so you can change the port here uh, i will just simply cancel it and i will uh, simply start this one and uh, database is uh, started and what i will do i will just simply mm, refresh this okay refresh oh. let me go back to this again and i will just simply root and login and it say cannot login into my sql server and uh, no such file and direct files let me let me stop this server and uh, start this one and send again okay yes 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 uh, let me uh, i don't need to uh, change the server i remember uh, you remember we open this uh, config file here okay here we have localhost we just need to change this to 12710 and this url okay and go back to this simply refresh this and login and boom your php 
PHP my admin is ready and you can use it you can create new databases and everything so that's how you can install uh, and set up laravel hard uh, php my admin and database uh, sql server and uh, you can use uh, laravel uh, like uh, locally and this is the all uh, all set up for uh, running laravel locally on your mac os machine so if you like this video please share this video with your friend and if you have any question about laravel hard or um, PHP my admin and my SQL DB engine everything you can ask me in the comment section